and welcome to Furry Ears World, where we are back in Project Ozone 2 land. Let's see how many bits of stuff... Oh my god, it's not, it's not too bad. It's not too bad. It's not too shabby. It's not enough, but it's not too shabby. We fixed the world problem that we were having with the Enderman. Uh, the thing has got bigger, you will note the thing has got bigger. I'm dropping Enderman. I'm not putting zombies in there. And I'm dropping Enderman a little bit further before I kill him, so hopefully the sword has a fighting chance of taking him down. Seems to be holding its own reasonably well. I'm not sure if we're getting anything of anything value out of here. Uh, we're probably getting Ender Pearls very slowly. It d just that sword just doesn't seem to be doing any damage when it's in there. I don't know why that is. See, there's a lot of Enderman in there. I can thin the herd out dramatically with this sword just like that because this sword one shots them but if I put it in there it stops one shotting them don't understand why it makes no sense to me whatsoever but it seems to be holding its own and it's doing a job so we're just gonna leave that for now doing doing that uh, we're gonna see if we are actually getting anything useful out of there and in the meantime I've got a dog growling at me as well he's not happy about something uh, in the meantime we got uh, machines to make work better so we need um, augments we need these augments here these ones we need four f Ooh, how many can we get one two one two three four five six seven eight would be good and eight we got cool that's good we'll need four straight away and the rest can be be, be dealt with at a later date now this one's still running this one did did kind of wig out on us a little bit but it's still going at the moment so we'll just bang that in there and that'll make that whole thing go a little bit faster and then that one can go in there that can go a little bit faster and then that can go in there that can go a little bit faster if we over augment the... I apologize for the dog I, I just don't know what he's doing I don't know whether this will catch up or not it might do we can always take half a stack out of there and pop it in there and see if that helps. Hopefully these will all, all top up to the to Brimmington. So we've got four in there. We've got four stacks in there. So this is ninth magnitude demon steel. This is pretty good stuff. This is pretty good, strong, robust stuff that we're dealing with here. That can't make its mind up, can it? That's gone up to nearly full already. This one seems to be having problems with something. I'm not sure what. I'm not entirely sure why this one's having issues, but it is having issues. It does seem to be a little bit bogged down, that one, but it's going. It's doing the job. And we are getting a steady stream of Temperio Essence coming into here. Kind of like quite a few at a time. We don't really need all these mind you if we overload it it's not going to work well so we'll, we'll leave it as it is we'll leave it as it is four going into one um, then upstairs we've got to do got to get power to these for starters that's that's the thing we need to do we need to throw the augments in so that these run at the right speed once they're powered of course uh, we're not going to be able to power it till the morning but that's okay that's not the end of the world where the hell did that go that didn't go anywhere did I put that in the wrong place? I did try and put that in the wrong slot, didn't I? There was a little bit of muppetry there. Uh, just, just a scotch of muppetry. Uh, there's not too many Endermen wandering about. I am concerned that Endermen will break loose. So everything's got its stuff on. We need to put some Temperio Essence in the system. So we'll just go and grab half a stack out of here, because we can. And we will... Whoops, Daisy we will say that is pulling Temperio Essence. These should all be set right. It should just be a case of putting Temperio Essence in. That's all we should really need to do. Like so. Um, and the outputs need Temperio Essence and I think I'm not 100% sure but I think these, these chests should be making Temperio Essence too. That's what I'm thinking. So let's see. Yeah, they should be making Temperio Essence too. So when the Demon Steel comes in, they turn it into Temperio Essence and it goes into a feedback loop. That's, that's the principle. We get a vicious feedback loop that 
just just makes everything go wah wah wee wah wah wah. Right, so if we get some power on these, this will fire up and everything will be epic. Uh, let's just stick two Temperio in there, two Temperio in there, two Temperio in there, and hopefully two Temperio in there. Boop, boop. Jobs are good. So that's making Demon Steel Ninth Magnitude good. I think everything is pretty much hunky dory there. Let's go see if we've got any Enderman Souls yet. Just a lot of experience blurting out of the thing. No, I've still only got the one. That's gone up to 176, but that could have been when I was railing on it with the sword. They are dying in there. There is death happening, because there's the amount of experience pouring out of the thing shows that there's death happening in there. But it is a worry. It is a worry that it's not being as efficient as it could be. Right, we need power. We need conduit. Uh, conduit. Duct. We need duct. Duct is what we need. These, these jobbies here, and a solar panel. Just you know, because completeness and stuff. And oop, let's throw them on the floor, shall we? You can't put them that side. They have to go that side, and then they drop across. So we have got a solar panel. Good. So we need to get power to these bad boys. Now we could do this up here, or we could nobble underneath and put the power through the roof kind of thing. That's a, that's, I think that's my preferred option. So we need to take out that block, which is the wrong block. So we did put these in the wrong place. Okay, well that's fair enough. I'm, I'm happy enough that they're in the wrong place. Uh, it was close. No cigar, but it was close. So there should be one there, and we're stuck in the middle now. There should be one. Wow, kind of got hung up a little bit there. One there, yep, yeah, excellent. So we go that, that, that. Uh, I think we'll just take this through the window at the back. Uh, do we want, yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, sure, why not? Didn't want to place that. A little bit annoying, but yeah, we got there. We got there. We achieved what we needed to. What we set out to do, we achieved. So there is a center run in here, which we can't get at, because life is like that. So we can do that. I'd like to get this in place before the sun comes up, which is pretty soon, I think. Yeah, because the moon, which is looking beautiful tonight, I have to say, is about to go down. So we'll do that, and we will throw another solar panel upon this bad boy here. And it's getting light already. Yeah, there's a little bit of light going in there. So these should now be firing up. They are. That's filling up nicely. That's filling up nicely. That's kind of not. And that's kind of not. So there does seem to be a, a definite sort of twitchiness about this system that, that isn't quite perfect. Maybe if I just flooded the thing with uh, Temperio Essence. Maybe if I do this. Wow, that ate that Demon Steel real damn quick. Alright, that's filled up that one. That one's still struggling. That one's doing okay. That one's doing okay. I guess it just needs a kick in the backside to get it going. So this is doing its job. It's doing it remarkably well. We are building up quite the backlog of Temperio Essence here. It can't chew it up as fast as it's coming in, so I guess this system is working. Okay. We seem to have a bit of an Enderman problem now. Let's go and let's go and tidy this up. There are a few in there. There's not a lot. There's only two or three in there. I guess the rest of them are just milling around out here. Still only mob, only one mob soul. Yeah. See, this sword one-shots everything unless you put it in the autonomous activator, in which case it doesn't anymore. You need to die. You need to die. You need to die. Okay. Someone's picking up grass. That's not acceptable. 
I'm not that keen on them being in the village either. If they turn all my villagers loose, I'm going to be very upset. I shouldn't lose any villagers because we're we're sealed on this platform. We are we have got doors all the way around on the vital edges. You can walk off, but I think you'd be a stupid villager to do it. So theoretically, we're going to get souls. We haven't had any yet, but theoretically, we are going to get them. So we're just going to leave that doing do for the time being. It seems to have, you know, cleared the backlog. Yeah, there's none none in there, so it is working. A few more just keep popping in there and, and the sword gets them. And so the system does kind of work. It's not great. Um, it needs vast amounts of improving. But we're kind of limited because of having used the bedrock and the uh, obsidian building it. That kind of, kind of blocks us a little bit from making any other progress on that. So we are now making a stupid amount of EMC in the form of the the do doing machines back there. Uh, we need to look at. I think there's there's a there's a red matter tool that makes a lot of EMC as well. But I'll look at that in a bit. I'll look at that in a bit. That's that's a job for another time. Let's have a look at the quest book. What is the other thing that we need to make for quest books? Whoop. Mew. Uh, Mew, probably not going to help us. I don't think Mew's going to help us here. Yeah, there's not a lot to do in Mew. I think the Morning Star's the big hitter, isn't it? Let's have a look at the Morning Star. Let's, 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 having said I wouldn't do it, let's have a look at it. The Morning Star is that much EMC. And that's considerably more than all the components that make it up, I think. So. I mean, it's possible we could do a Morningstar machine. But it would be a complicated thing, feeding from multiple sources. I much prefer the simple, the simple life on that one. I'm I'm lazy in that that respect. I I prefer the simple life. Come on, let me get to Mew. Thank you. I don't know what we're in there. Um. So we have made that. The next thing we need to make is the neutrino compressor. And the neutrino compressor is a complicated pig that takes this menu system, doesn't it? This crafting table thing. Uh. N E U T neutrino compressor. So we need blocks of neutrinium stuff. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. So we need twenty five neutrinium ingots. Neutronium ingots. Can we do that? Uh N E U pile of uh, neutrinos. We can make twenty-eight of them, which makes us three of them. So we have got a way to go yet. Considering we need twenty-five, we've been going for a couple of hours, and we have got four. It's a damn shame they haven't got an EMC value. It really is. N E U. Yeah, it's a damn shame they're not EMCable. But hey ho, you can't have everything in life. Yeah, they're not EMCable. Shame, pity. Maybe we just need more of these bad boys. We could easily make another seven of them and, and double the output. But we'll 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 cross that bridge at a later date. So what else is I mean, we, these are the points which, which are stuck, really, aren't they? The cosmic meatballs means we've got to farm some animals. Uh, the animals aren't going to like that. We need to find another sheep. But I think between episodes, I'll go and find a sheep. There's an enderman starting to get on my nerves. I've made, a, I've created a monster at this enderman farm. I really have. 
I really have created a disgusting, monstrous, hideous thing. But hey-ho, it needed to be done. So maybe I need to do some animal farming. Maybe that's a way forward so that we've got sources of meat and whatnot and, and shiz and waz. What I really want is this system working properly. But I think it's just going to be wait and see on that. So I think from Furrier's World for now, where we've got our EMC machine going like the clappers. That one's struggling so much it's not true, but... Why is this not making Demon Steel of the ninth magnitude? Um, something's gone wrong there. That's not doing what it's supposed to do. This one is. But that one upstairs ain't doing it. Ain't cutting the grade. Ain't, ain't, ain't working. I need you to make that. I don't get it. Why is that not being successful at making Demon Steel of the Ninth Order? That makes no sense to me. But hey ho, I'll figure that out. So, from Furrier's world for now, we are going to go with a cheery old ta-ta.